This is an introduction to the leading edge integration which we have just done. Now when you put an order in with leading edge it will automatically be posted into purchase orders currently on order here. So you put the order in through the leading edge portal and when it's sent from that portal or I think they call it the extranet or intranet then it will appear here in leading edge and currently on order. Now <clears throat> like with many features we add it's just a beginning what we've come to realize is that um, you probably really need these orders in the carts and ideally you want to be able to send orders to leading edge from circle rather than the other way around but we'll slowly progress our way towards that uh, initially this is how it works you put any orders put in um, on the leading edge side will get sent through to currently on order in circle now if you're interested to try this out the way to turn it on is to go to the back office and settings and you'll see there's leading edge ABI keys here you click a button you'll get this key and you'll get your user URL in this case retail.circlesoft.net you go to leading edge and in the user settings section you'll see there now there's a box for use circle integration if you tick that and put that um, retail will go here in that case so if you're a shop like um, let me think of one timeout you put timeout then dot circlesoft.net um, and then the api key goes in here and save and when you've done that automatically your orders put in here will be put in currently on order so we will uh, the next phase is to try and get the offers back into circle so you can actually see what the specials are inside the stock system and um, to potentially get rather than going to um, currently on order perhaps bring these orders back to the cart stage before they're sent so you have some visibility of what you've got sitting with the leading edge as well which is pretty important for staff in the shop